morning, guys. It is day four of our journey through the song, It Is Well. And today, we're focusing on verse four. And Lord, haste the day when my faith shall be silent. The clouds be rolled back as a scroll. The trump shall resound, and the Lord shall descend. Even so, it is well with my soul. This verse clearly depicts the hope that we um, who have faith in Christ Jesus, that all things will be restored when he returns for us. It is that place of peace and hope that says, no matter what is going on, we wanna trust and believe that in the end, the promise that the word teaches us will come to pass. And that means there's no more hurting, there's no more pain, there's no more earthly sorrows. So as the Lord hastes the day, my faith shall be sight when all that I have believed has come to pass. The clouds are rolling back as a scroll. The trump shall resound, which is the, the, the alarm that lets us know that day has come when the Lord shall descend. Even so, it is well with my soul. In Matthew chapter 11, verse 28, it says, Come to me, all who labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. I believe that until that day, we are to have faith and trust and know that the, the earthly um, tensions uh, from illnesses um, to sin, to depression, all of this is temporary. Though in the moment when we're walking through it and living it, it does not feel temporary. And sometimes it can be so, um, so heavy and hard to understand and process and walk through that it can seem like it's going to be the end of all this side of heaven but because of jesus and through jesus we are able to find a rest because of our faith that he can bring healing but as this song says the lord shall descend which means he will return and when he does he is returning to restore everything that is broken taking those who have true faith in him home to heaven where we will be no longer in these bodies and the pains of this world, the, the cancer that we see and face that is such a, 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 a life destroying disease that, that sees no innocent person. It takes and it attacks those in whom it, in which it desires. Um, it is truly of the devil. But when Jesus returns, all of that sickness is removed. All of that hurt is restored. Those who have gone before, um, who were in Christ Jesus, and those who are still on earth are reunited. So there is peace, there is healing, there is restoration. There is a moment where all things will be realigned according to the Father's will. So even so, the day that we are walking through today can be filled with a lot of heartache and hurt and pain. I know that there are people in this moment who are preparing to probably get ready to go for another chemo treatment or someone who is completely um, lost and struggling and not sure where they are in their own faith. I want to encourage you to have the faith, to trust and to believe, to know that the healing of this world, the hurting of this world is temporary. But the healing in Christ is everlasting. And one day when he does return, the eternal rejoicing, the eternal healing that those who have faith in him will receive is the greatest hope that we can have this side of heaven. God, I come to you right now just in awe of the peace that we really can find as we rest in Jesus or we find ourselves clinging to Jesus in the season of doubt, in the season of fear. Um, the physical pain sometimes may not ease, but the peace that Jesus can bring our heart, God, can outweigh that physical pain because we have faith and hope and trust that all your promises will come to pass. And the clouds will be rolled back. The trumps will uh, resound. And the Lord will 
struggled to sin, to make all things new, all things right, and restore and rebuild and recreate us as we will be welcomed into the gates of heaven and leave back all of the brokenness that we have walked through or experienced and seen here on this earth. God, I thank you for your grace and your mercy, and I pray that today we see you cling to you and we find rest in you and you alone. Oh Lord, each day when my faith shall be silent or the clouds be rolled back as a scroll and the trump shall so much for joining me let's keep the faith and trust and know that our savior will return so all the things of this world is temporary the pain the hurt the brokenness and one day we will be you reunited with the love greater than man could ever give I look forward to worshiping with you guys tomorrow have a blessed day